I never really got up here and spoke on how I feel about Deshaun Porter versus Terrence Crawford potential fight. But I'm going to lay it all out. I'm going to cook on it real quick. Check this out, man. Early on, it seemed like um, there was early on talks about them two fighting. They cool. They're good friends. You know, it was kind of like Bud didn't want to fight him. Sean didn't want to fight Bud. But now Sean is saying, fuck it. Let's get it. Bud is saying, well, you know, if you call, go to the WBO and holler at him and activate the mandatory thing and we can get it on or whatever. I personally think Bud should just come out and say, fuck it. Let's go. It's, it's, go, it's go time. But here, here's the thing, though. Why do I think? I think that fight needs to happen. You know why? Because it will kind of like, in a way, force Errol Spence's hand, and it'll it'll kind of it'll show us all where. Because there's a lot of speculation on Errol Spence, man, right now. I'm just being honest, man. There's a lot of speculation on if he's really ducking. Because parts parts of me feel like. He want to fight Bud because it's like a lot of things he say. Then there's parts of me that feels like he he's low key ducking him or he's worried about something. And if Bud fights Sean, let's just say, man, the reason why they should fight is it gives Bud the chance to possibly stop Sean Porter, man. And a lot of people don't believe that can happen. But you gotta understand, this is how I this is how I see Bud versus Arrow as far as their skill set. Arrow has tools in the bag. I think Bud just has more tools. I I, I watch them in all of their fights. And Bud Terrence Crawford just has more tools than Arrow Spence, in my opinion. I know other people not gonna agree. That's fine. You're welcome to your opinion, but I like both of them. But you know, I I just see more in Terrence Crawford. I just I just do. Well, Arrow showed a lot of grit. He's a gritty dude, and he showed remarkable. I think he was fighting better than he fought in, in the Sean Porter fight. He looked he looked more sharp fighting Danny, even though he said he wasn't even at a hundred percent. I think Arrow was looking more sharp when he was fighting Danny than he did when he fought Sean. Because he was less focused when he was fighting Sean. He was more focused when he went up with Danny. But in the case of Terrence Crawford versus Sean Porter, man, if if Terrence Crawford gets in there when they fight and he stops Sean and Errol doesn't call him out or don't even show up to the fight, or he don't want no parts of Bud, bro. Which I don't understand because... You said you want to unify. You the one that said that you're not moving up until you fight Crawford and get the belts. But then, like, if I see that fight, and it, and I'm telling you, if he stops, but if he stops Sean Porter, that is gonna put tremendous pressure on Errol Spence to step to Crawford. Like, okay, well, do that to me. The way you stop Sean, stop me like that. If he stops Sean. And Errol didn't stop Sean. And if Terrence Crawford does stop Sean and he doesn't acknowledge the fact that he want to get in the ring with Bud, I think that'll show the world, like, all right, damn, he just stopped Sean. This dude is dangerous. Nobody stopped Sean. Nobody was able to stop Sean, man. People have put Sean down, but nobody stopped him, like, as far as knocked him out cold. Or nobody was able to, or the ref didn't have to wave off the fight. If Crawford gets in there and knocks him out cold, or it's a stoppage by the ref, that's going to, we, we going to see how Errol Spence reacts to that. And that'll tell us everything we need to know right there. That's why Terrence Crawford needs to fight Sean Porter. Because... Him fighting Errol ain't happening. Not right now. I had said in my previous video that I saw that fight happening. If Bud leaves top rank, I see the fight happen in November, December, or February, January, February of 2022. But 
right now we need to see how Bud we need Bud and Sean to fight. I want to see that fight. I want to see that fight. And I'm telling you, I'm just getting a weird feeling that if he stops Sean, we gonna probably if if Errol ain't who he say he is, if he not really free smoke junior, then we'll never see that fight, man. Let me know what you think. Like and subscribe. Watch Rebel Life Boxing.